Welcome back. We are here looking at the, the ETFs. It is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, June 29, 2021. If you like to support the channel, you're going to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos. And we'll start by looking at ARK Innovation ETF. And as you can see, we did gap up when the uh, market start opened and then we rallied significantly. We're up at 3.75% to the day. And uh, at this point, it is getting very overstretched. You can see here in the bullet band, we are way outside. We are at 83 in the RSI and... And for tomorrow's session, it is fairly likely that we'll see this tumble or at any point this week that if this continues, it will start to tumble because, um, yes, we are getting very overstretched at this point. However, technical indicators, we can see that MACD is still very bullish. Sarcastic is bullish and CCI is also bullish. We are above the 100 moving average and we are above the 150 moving average. And uh, pullbacks at this point, they will most likely be bought into around the 150 or 100 moving average. We can see that the um, 20 exponential is moving this way and it's going to cross the 100 and the 150. And pullbacks into this area will basically be buying opportunities. So let's look at the DVI. So DVI has uh, broken down today. We're down roughly 1%. It got rejected here at the 20 exponential. And if we look at other technical indicators, we can see that MACD is still very bearish. Stochastic is bullish. The RSI is bearish. And so is the CCI. We can see that we are pulling back towards the bottom of uh, the bullish band. So we could expect this to continue falling and uh, roughly 2.1% uh, to the downside. That will also mean that we'll break below the... 100 moving average, but you could see that this uh, falls to the 100 moving average and then rallies to the upside. We need to break above the 50 in order to go back towards these levels. Break below the 100 moving average, then we could actually be heading towards 150. And that's another 5% to the downside. So let's look at VTI. So VTI is up uh, just a little bit, 0.07% uh, at this current stage. We are at the top of the bullish band, so a pullback is expected anytime this week. Um, MACD is still bullish, the CASIC is bullish, CCI is bullish, and the RSI is technically flat. There's still a lot of room to the upside, but a pullback towards the middle of the bullish band or the 20 exponential down here at the 220, that could be what we'll see before going higher to or it's 225. So let's look at MCHI. So this continues to rally. We're up uh, half a percent today, but it got rejected here at the 150 moving average. So if you get a red candlestick here tomorrow, then we'll probably tumble back down. So I did mention this um, in my last video yesterday. It tends to rally significantly at the end of uh, each month. We can see it here, we can see it here, and we can also see it right now here. So that could mean that we'll start tumbling uh, in the beginning of July and head back towards the 300 moving average or these previous lows. So we're we're technically making higher lows here, but it, it's only just. So we haven't tested uh, the 300 moving average or haven't uh, gotten down to that uh, moving average, but... We are going higher, but at the end of each month, it seems this has a pullback. At the beginning of each month, it has a pullback before rallying at the end of the month. We're also getting to the top of the, the Bollinger Band here. So yes, we could see this pulling back towards the 79 around that area. So if you look at MACD, it's bullish, the RSI is bullish, CCI is bullish, and the Stochastic is bullish as well. But if we break above this uh, 84 level here then it's very likely that we are going back towards the very highs so let's look at ibv so also here we're up at 0 0.17 percent and uh, we're also getting very overstretched here so a pullback towards the middle of the bullish band that could be expected uh, a drop of roughly 1.2 percent to the downside before uh, rallying again we are in up jump and all of these pullbacks have been highly bought into both the 50, 40, and the 20 exponential moving average all offer a massive uh, support. 
Technical indicators we can see the MACD is bullish, RSI is flat, CCI is bullish, and stochastic is bullish as well. So, hope you found this helpful. If you want to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos. And good luck, and thank you very much.